shopping is in the Storm Tracker Center with our Tuesday forecast. More rain on the way, but what about those temperatures? Yeah, uh, well, temperatures actually this morning, Julia, they're pretty warm, especially in the valley. We're going to be showing you that in just a second. Uh, for the afternoon, close to a little above average for most areas. And what we're going to be seeing moving forward, a big jump in temperatures on the way. More rain and snow continuing today, really through tomorrow. Thunderstorms very much possible today as well in many areas of the valley and foothills. And then sunny and warmer conditions are on the way late this week through your upcoming weekend. Winter storm warning in effect right now in the northern Sierra. This is set to continue through early tomorrow morning right now set to expire at 6 a.m. Wednesday, but we could see that extended snow levels today for the Sierra and Southern Cascades down to as low as 4000 feet by this afternoon could see them as low as 2500 feet tomorrow. Winter storm warning for Siskiyou County today through 10 a.m. and then tonight 10 p.m. through 4 p.m. tomorrow winter weather advisories going into effect for Trinity and Siskiyou counties. For the Southern Cascades areas of Lassen and Plumas counties, we have a winter weather advisory through 4 a.m. tomorrow down to 5,500 feet. Could see some decent snowfall on the way today and early tomorrow as well. Temperatures this morning starting out in the mid 50s for many valley areas. 40s in most foothill areas, 30s to 40s in the mountains to start the day. Getting a look at the wind right now, mostly out of the south. Not quite as strong as 30 minutes ago, but still pretty decent out there. 18 miles an hour out of the south in Chico, 16 miles an hour out of the south in Orville, 18 miles an hour, or 15 that is, miles an hour out of the south in Red Bluff. Satellite and radar showing the showers continuing to move north into our region overnight. You can see the low pressure area off the coast right now pulling that moisture in. Now that's going to continue to track through our region today into tomorrow. So what's going to happen? We're going to be seeing heavy periods of rain on the way throughout the day today, most of which are going to be on the eastern side of the valley, foothills and heading up into the Sierra early to midday. The chance for thunderstorms really picks up early to mid afternoon. You can see here Tehama and Shasta County looking like the most likely areas where that will occur with a chance in the foothills this afternoon as well. And then on the back side of this system, we see another round of rain and snow moving in tomorrow. This is going to allow us to see some lower snow levels potentially possible tomorrow, and then that fizzles out by tomorrow afternoon. Rain totals through tonight. We're looking at mostly less than a quarter of an inch in the valley. The exception here, Redding, potentially around a third of an inch. Higher elevations up to around a half an inch for most locations. Tomorrow we'll see a bit more on the way. Not a lot for the valley, but it does push us close to a half an inch in Redding. Quarter inch or so in Chico. Higher elevations, maybe an inch in a few areas squeezed out of this storm. Snow through tonight. We're looking at five inches for Chester, around eight inches possible in Mineral. Heading to tomorrow. Merrill going up to around 10 inches, 6 inches in Chester. So we'll squeeze just a touch more snow out of this tomorrow. And then you get a look at what we're seeing for today. Temperatures in the 40s for the northern mountains. Rain and snow in the forecast. The snow level 3,000 feet. Snow level down to as low as 4,000 feet in the Sierra and Southern Cascades. Today with 30s to 40s in your forecast. Rain showers and the chance for thunderstorms this afternoon and evening in the foothills with highs in the 40s. And if you're in the valley, it's mid 50s to low 60s. Today, rain showers looking likely with the chance for afternoon thunderstorms. Julia in your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast where your weekend's always in view. More rain on the way heading through early to midday Wednesday. That fizzles out Wednesday night tomorrow also a bit cooler than what we'll see outside for today. Temperatures back up to the low 60s with sunshine on Thursday and we'll see gusty north winds developing late this week and then sunshine and mid 60s through your Super Bowl weekend. Super Bowl Sunday looking absolutely amazing. So plan ahead to get outdoors as we head through this upcoming weekend. All right.